Hello everyone and welcome. My name is Bobby and you're watching Mind Island Design. Today I want to show you how you can easily turn an illustration into a die cut sticker in Illustrator. These are a couple apparel designs I created last November for a client to help promote men's health. And if you want to see more artwork like this, definitely go check out our social media pages. Let's say I want to turn this design into a die cut sticker. You want to begin by copying it with Command C and pasting it in place with Command Shift and V. Now if I go to my layers, you'll see that there are two of this design. You want to select the bottom layer for this, but for the tutorial, I'll select the top layer so you can actually see what I'm doing. You want to open up your Pathfinder panel, and if you don't see it there, you can also go to Window and select Pathfinder. You want to select the Unite option, which will merge all of the different objects together. If I go into this group here, you'll see how my illustration is just made up of different shapes. And then you'll want to make this the color of your outline, which most of the times it's white. And then make that transparent. And then I'll just drag this below my design. So now if I go to Object, Path, and Offset Path, and select Preview, this outline, as you can see, is your die cut. So you can adjust the, the offset size to your likings. So I think 35 actually looks good. So I'll select OK. Now you'll select your bottom layer and your top illustration because um, when you select OK to the offset path, it'll just create a new layer. Now, if I paste it down here, you'll see that this is your die cut sticker. Now, a bit more of an advanced tip is actually setting up this white outline to be ready for a printer to use this path to cut. Most printers use a certain swatch name to recognize a path as a cut path. And to do that, you'll wanna go to your swatches panel. Again, if you don't see it, you can go to Windows and select Swatches. So if we create a new swatch, you want to title it Cut Contour and make sure it's spelt this way with capital letters and no spaces. Color type will be Spot Color and Color Mode, let's just do CMYK for printing. And these settings don't really matter. Again, if you want to change the color of your cut path, you can do that. So yeah, that is how you can easily create a die cut sticker in Illustrator. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. What? <laughs>